Hey everyone, I am Nate Bramley here with Xbox Australia and New Zealand, joined by Mr. Major Nelson. How are we? Nate, I am so happy to join you today. You look great. You're, you're you. over here. How's your E3 going? My E3 is going fantastically so far. I am loving the aircon. It is a bit of a change from the Sydney winter weather sure. that we have, right. but I am acclimatizing quite right, I see nicely. All you, all you packed is a t-shirt. Yeah, no, I don't think I need anything <laughs> else uh, other than that. So continuing on with your role, what do you think is the most important part for you? Like, What is the part that you really take away at the end of the day with a smile on your face? I think what it is is, is it's it's making people it's giving people the the joy and satisfaction and the entertainment with xbox with all of the titles we bring and the moments of using connections with xbox live uh, and all of that element so that's really what what i get is is with the great products we build how it connects people in terms of actual connections yes. social connections but the moments that we have with the games and continuing on there are so many aspects to e3 we were talking about your connections and stuff like that that are established through Xbox and the community. Yeah. Are there any other huge aspects of this period of time, of the three days that are E3, that is important to you? Sure, and I think what it is, it's really represented by the conversation we're having here, is that what we do here on this stage and at E3 here in LA goes around the world, mm. right? You flew, this is your first time to America. Yes, it is first time to America, and, and, E3, everything. Yeah, I mean, it's so, so the fact that all the eyes of the gaming world, the actual world are on us is, is pretty, is pretty amazing. It's a little insane. I've forgotten to uh, inhale and then exhale sure, occasionally clear. while being here. Have you passed out? And final question, there are moments in games that really make people sit down and go, whoa. Sure. Is there any particular moment in gaming that really sticks out to you that you've kind of been taken back by it? Well, I mean, th that's the beauty of the games and the narrative. Uh, games combine wonderful technology with incredible storytelling. I mean, in, just in the past year alone, that happens frequently. Certainly, we have those emotions that we saw when we saw Ori and the next version of Ori coming along. But just recently, um, you know, one of the big moments, and I, I, I hesitate to share this because it, it can be a spoiler for some people, is okay. have spoiler, you finished? Spoiler, spoiler warning. Have you finished spoiler. Red Dead? Yes. Okay. No. But there's, there's, and again, there's a little bit of spoiler here. Apologies, don't watch. But if you remember correctly, in that moment, there, before that we got to that, that engagement, mm. there's a moment where he says goodbye to his horse. Do you remember that? I do. I, it was, to me personally, it was a little bit of a weird instant. But then as the uh, scene continues, right. you're like, oh, oh wow, wow, this is that it. had some gravity this to is it. it. Right. Yeah. Right. You're, you don't really understand what you're doing. So I just remember being there, and it was very emotional. And, and of course, the guys and girls at Rockstar just create amazing moments. So that moment with Red Dead uh, towards the end, Red Dead Redemption 2, towards the end was just extraordinary. The same thing happened with Red Dead, the original. Yeah. For me, I was where. I say, I had a similar feeling in Fable 2 when right. your dog dies. Right. Yeah. 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 It's very emotional. Spoilers if you haven't played <laughs> Fable 2. I probably should have started that yeah, sentence with that. But uh, yeah, so I mean, the, the fact that games can create that powerful moment and emotional connection and give you chills. Yeah. Like, you know, I got it a few times on stage when we saw the Gears 5 spot with Kate, you know, with her face and all of bouncing out. I mean, that's really amazing. Um, there's just so many moments that happen that, ga that games can do for us that, you know, a lot of, whether it's a great book or a great piece of music or an amazing movie, but games are now up there and in some ways eclipse it. But no, thank you so very much for My your time pleasure. today. My pleasure.